Hang on. <laughs> right, morning everybody. In the Azores, and we've woken up to a bit of a wet one. So I think we're gonna have to change the schedule around a bit. The golf was gonna have to move to the afternoon, me thinks. Even though the golf is maybe cancelled. Breakfast is not it? Nah, you always got it. Yeah, that's so. Amen, bruh. Right, breakfast was yummy. Food at this place is pretty stunning. The weather is still a little wet. It's not as bad, and it's forecast to clear, so we might be having an afternoon game today. Today's swing, we're going to just try and tidy up the back swing a little bit in order to try and change the club path a fraction. He's a little bit out to in, he gets a little bit of cuts off to the right. I'm not keen on the body sloping towards the target so much at the top of the back swing. What we see on a downswing is quite a big push away with the arms, which is very good for making that path go a little bit left. It can kind of make you get down to the ground a little bit too early sometimes and get that path coming left after it's got to its lowest point. So we're just going to kind of shuffle up the backswing a little bit and see if we can just help this player push their path a fraction more maybe towards target or even to the right. Right, golf is not on at the moment. So there's steam coming out of the ground over there. That is a very steep hill there. And this is a big lake here. Can you hear that bubbling under there? Listen to that, that is just the earth. Well, it looks a little on the warm side in there. That is just bubbling away, isn't it? There's some fire in the belly of this beast, isn't there, that? Yeah. Right? Oh, planet Earth. <laughs> Do you know his serve, ladies and gentlemen? <laughs> Right, we've eaten our dinner from the ground. How was your uh, ground food, Matt? That was a proper stew from yeah, Mother Earth, nice delivered straight to coach. Yeah, it was like melting your mouth stuff, wasn't it? Oh, it was, it was right tender. <laughs> oh, it's just fallen yeah. right off the bone. It has, yeah, it's good. Lovely. Yeah. And now we're going to the golf course. Woohoo! So let's go play golf, eh? Yeah. So first idea is built around the way you turn. I don't like the way we see your upper body going this way. Very good for getting your hands quite close and then as you start your downswing, chucking everything away. That's very good for chucking everything away and out to this side for people. Often the pattern with that one is out to impasse, which is what you're kind of seeing with your cut shots. Simple idea, look. Get your driver, put it up the middle of your spine, and have it making sure it's tilted slightly away from the target. Make sure you're never tilting it this way. That's a common setup problem with amateurs, certainly ones who want to cut the ball. And then simple drill, as you make your backswing, I want you to feel like you're turning this, that side of the head, so the grip stays that side of the head. Your movement, this way, I want you to feel like you're turning. You can see how the head stays inside my feet as the shaft and the grip comes from over my right foot. Even though this is slightly exaggerated, this will give you a much better feeling for making this backswing, which creates this better turn, which I think might help you get down on a slightly better path. If we can just shift that path a little bit more to the right, I think you're gonna hit some good shots. Ryan Little. <laughs> Just go in the room. You ready for this? Bathroom, pleasant, nice. Bedroom, all very nice. Little bit of outside space. Oh my God, look at this. What a room. <laughs> <laughs> all right, neighbor. <laughs> I thought you were there. Let's for Rory to pop his head out there. All right, neighbor. <laughs> We could have a TV series from here, couldn't we? Please, thanks for talk. Right, next tip is from the window reflection. I mean mirror reflection. Now, I love mirror work. It really helps people, great off course. So what I'm going to do, no club, hands kind of by my side or behind me, I'm going to use this Leo Golf Travel logo and I'm going to try and get it stacking on top of my zip. So I can feel here that it's stapping, stacking on top of my zip as I turn. It's going to give me the feeling of how I'm turning my body. You're going to be moving this way. So you can see your Golf Travel logo zip way over here. So your Golf Travel logo going down, going over my zip of my coat. Not 
Oh, that way the way you're going. Such a simple way to get the feel of that movement and a really effective way to kind of build that feeling in off the course. And some ranges put reflections and mirrors around for you. Great, always use them if you can. I'm just finishing this tip on that because look at it. Why would you not? Reflection work in there. Then look at that and do a bit more reflection work. Then look at that. That was good food, wasn't it, Matt? Nice buffet. Um, buffet. Maybe a little posh Ooh. on me. They're steady on. Oh, right, let's go. Where Seven. are these whales? Come on. Hang on. <laughs> <laughs> go on, do it. 